What's up everybody, it's Fatty Mansi here from Real Results Fitness and in this video what we're going to be doing is going over our weight and our body fat percentage. If you don't know what I'm referring to, please go watch the first video so you know exactly what I'm talking about. I have here with me today a special guest, Jay Smooth. Back at it again. What I suggested to Fatty was for us to go to our local Nutri shop and go get our body fat tested on the in-body test. And this actually helped me a lot last year when I was cutting. I was started at about 20% and got down to about 14%. And the good thing about this machine is that you go every month and it keeps you accountable because it tracks your weight and body fat. Which is the same thing we're gonna be doing here. And in this next set of videos, what you're gonna see is a detailed breakdown of our body fat percentage and our weight. It's just muscle in the body. So we're holding about 40 pounds of muscle in the body to about 41 pounds of fat, of fat in the body. Mm -hmm. So you're athletically you're splitting it. Mm -hmm. You're splitting the fat and muscle, which is a good thing to have. Now we just want to focus on more of the muscle build that we're moving to the new year, yeah. getting closer, uh, spring, summertime. Percentage of body fat on the average, we want you to be around this uh, 15 to 18% range, mm -hmm. about 22% today. Mm -hmm. This could have fluctuated, bro. It could have been anywhere from 19 to 20% this morning when you woke up. Mm -hmm. You know, I don't know if you've woken up or, or worked out or drinking or eating anything, but that that'll play a role oh, okay, yeah. in the times you do it. That's when you weigh yourself, they always say do it first thing in the morning because mm -hmm. you have had nothing in your system. Yeah, yeah. Everything's been, you know what I mean? So that's the way it works. The, the, uh, the lean analysis here is basically your muscle density from upper body to lower body, okay? Um, on the average, this is where you should be. The gray area is where you are. Mm -hmm. Upper body will will always show a higher uh, density in muscle because we have more muscle up there. Back, shoulders, chest, biceps, triceps, forearms, everything. There's so much more on the upper body yeah. as opposed we to just the lower body. Your, your weight breaks it down for you. So you have what we're sitting at in weight, how much water we're holding in the body. Dry lean mass, again, is just straight muscle in the body, nothing else. Body fat mass for itself. The main things that we really want to look at is, like I said, metabolic rate, uh, muscle density. So you can see on the average of where you are, how much higher you are than most guys your height and age. And I can look at it just because I've done this a lot. It's right. much higher than you are. A couple are. of the reasons we do this, bro, to be honest with you, is it holds a few things accountable. It holds you accountable for yourself so you can actually see some progress. If you have a trainer, it holds your trainer accountable as well because your trainer is, is pro not necessarily promising, but it is educating you into how to achieve those goals in a faster manner and kind of your tutor inside the gym. You right. know? So this really holds both sides accountable, but it really creates an excitement for clients, for even for yourself, yeah. to see that, okay, it's not only the clothes that are feeling different or people are telling me that I'm looking good or right. I feel better, I can actually see it and see what's going on with my body, which really helps out. So my results came in and I'm weighing in at 188 and at 22% body fat. So for the three month transformation, I'm trying to lose about 13 to 15 pounds. Hopefully hit about 175 to 173 and hopefully I hit 15 to 12% body fat. And I weighed in at 203 even and currently sitting at 20.7% body fat. So my goal in these next three months is to get to 183. So that's about 20 pounds down. And that's what we're currently sitting at and our goals in the next months to come. Make sure to like, comment, and subscribe on this video. And stay tuned for the next video where James and myself are going to go over a day of nutrition.